Konami for the Game Boy. All right, we are playing uh, Contra, the uh, Alien Wars, I believe. Let's see. <laughs> yep, Contra the Alien Wars. Okay, I'm playing on the Visual Boy Advance emulator on my PC. So we've got a little color. It's not just black and white. Well, green, that ugly green, pea soup green with black. Okay, come on. Let's go to the options. Now, I'm going to set it to Maniac for difficulty, which is the hardest difficulty. And you may, if you're a first time watcher here, you may say, well, why would you do that? Well, because I'm cheating. <laughs> All right. Now, look, I already start with the spread gun. Check this out. Do, 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 do. And I should have infinite of these uh, bomb things. There we go. Rapid fire for the gun. I'm very glad about that. And no matter what weapon I pick up, it will stay the spread gun because I'm cheating. And I don't like the other weapons. I prefer the spread gun. See, like. There, I picked up the heat-seeking one. It didn't change. So I'm not going to go around purposely collecting all the different guns because I don't want them. The spread gun, you know, shoots wide. So I like it. Now watch this. Watch as I walk into bad guys. Watch what happens. Just watch. See, look. They just die by touching me. Look. Dead, 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 dead. See, that would have been good when we went to Walmart yesterday. Just walk into people and dead. Nah. Oh, we went to Walmart yesterday and it was terrible. I've never seen such an array of pregnant women in my life. I think every pregnant woman on earth was at Walmart yesterday. Everyone. Anyone that was carrying a kid was there. It was like an all points bulletin. Anyone pregnant has to be there. And in my way, I, it was must have been a very cold winter because every woman on earth was pregnant. Even the old ones, 80-year-olds. Yeah, I saw an 80-year-old pregnant woman. <laughs> okay, I didn't. Also, every kid in Walmart had to be bouncing a ball. It was a law. They passed it. When you walked in, they would actually stop you and go, Do you have a child with you? Yes. Then you need to have this ball. And you need to bounce it constantly. And you need to follow this big, tall, bald guy around and bounce it near him constantly. Or else you have to leave the store. So, every kid had to follow me around with a ball. Every child there. It was like, just shoot me, Lord. I don't know. I couldn't work at Walmart. I, I couldn't tolerate it. I couldn't tolerate it. Like too much. I don't know how people actually work at Walmart. Here I am playing this game talking about Walmart. But it's true though. You want to know something that's really terrible about our Walmart here in Auburn, Maine? You go down to the electronics department. You go there. You got different sounds. First of all, you get the music playing over the loudspeaker, right? And then... There's 8 million TVs hooked up. And every TV is set to a different channel. Every one of them. It has to be that way. It's just, again, it's a regulation they have. So, you're hearing the music. You're hearing 15 million different channels. You're hearing bouncing balls. You see what I'm saying? It's a cacophony of noise that you can't get away from. I was really miserable yesterday at Walmart to the point where I was like, my wife was asking me questions. What do you want? And it's like, what do I want? I want to leave. I don't care what you buy. I'll eat anything as long as we leave. That's all that mattered to me. I, I couldn't. Okay, can I walk into this thing? No, I can't. You can't step on it. Okay, fine. I'll shoot you then. Okay, how about this? Will that take care of it when it's open? Okay, good. So long. See, watch. I grabbed the F for fire. Nothing. And that's how I want it. 
Yeah, it was terrible at Walmart yesterday. I just was really miserable. I I told my wife, I said, look, if you want me to come back to Walmart, it has to be in the morning. I can't go at night anymore. Oh, also, what was what was something there? It, it must have been prom season for school. You know, we're at, what is it, May? So they're having prom. It's like 10,000 kids all dressed up like prostitutes. Oh my goodness, I saw this one young girl walk in. Her dress was literally slit up the front. I mean, where, you know, privacy should be uh, there, you know what I mean? Terrible. If I was her father, I would have lost my mind. It's like, how can you dress like that? You know, what is she, 18 years old? And she looks like a streetwalker. So after I took a bunch of pictures, no, I'm just kidding, I didn't. But uh, my daughter, I couldn't have my daughter like dressed like that. No, no. Well, you see this section, <clears throat> when you play the Super NES version of this game, to walk on these overhead parts, you have to press the L and R uh, shoulder buttons to rotate the camera. But this version, it's on the fly as it should be as it should be so that's good okay i'm just all right here we go right, let's just blow this thing up i'll shoot and i'll bomb it at the same time rapid fire man it's the only way to go when you play these games you gotta have rapid fire no rapid fire you almost want to forget it okay come on where i thought i got this thing down here didn't i oh there Oh, I see. I gotta go down, but now, now I gotta make my way to the right. All right. Okay, I got gotcha. you. And then down. All right, there it is. I shoot and bomb it at the same time. Not like I don't have enough bombs. Okay. Wow, the whole screen's shaking. Down and this way. Now it's just down. There it is. There. Done. Okay, there we go. Alright. Now this thing literally is on top of you the whole time. How could you not die? I mean, it's literally on top of you, no matter what. I mean, look at it. I can't even walk away from it because it's... Okay, you want me? I'll be right in your mouth as I bomb you forever. And shoot. Let's shoot and bomb. Oh, you didn't like that. I huh? disagreed with you? Well, maybe you should have gave me my personal space. Remember during the planda <coughs> pandemic where uh, you know you had six feet of space? Well, this alien should have learned his, the lesson. Get that. Get that. Yeah, you don't want to jump too high. If you go off screen, you actually die. So, it's just a thing. I put in a code to stop that. Yeah, it stops it all right. It literally stops it. It freezes it. So you can't, you know, you can't even play the game. So that code, I don't know who developed that code, but it was stupid. Oh yeah, disable it. Okay, but you're disabling the whole game, so why would you want it in the first place? Totally dumb. Sometimes I don't know what these people are actually thinking. Okay, more of these guys. You're not grabbing me. Okay, you can grab me. Okay, shoot, just bomb it. Just bomb it. It's easier if you just bomb it. There. There, gone. Oh, yeah, I gotta get on the wall here. You know, I know this is Game Boy, but I think it's pretty good. This guy can't touch me. You can't touch me. Do, 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 do. 
Yeah, this part, I always try to shoot it, even though basically you just need to avoid it. Because shooting it is a waste of time, it ain't gonna do anything. But I always hope against hope that it'll work. And it won't. The end. <laughs> yeah, Contra is one of my favorite game series. With codes. No codes, no play. And that goes with everything I play anyway, so it doesn't need to be said, because that's just how it is. Bombing, bombing, and bombing. Okay, you're going to take a million shots? Well, how about this? There, dead. Yeah, I don't know if other people are the way I am about Walmart. But it, it is a terrible place. It really is. It's like Jeff Dunham's puppet said, get your crap and get out. I mean, literally, I, I agree with the puppet. Get your stuff and leave. Alright, is this that thing that... Oh, no, I'm thinking of... Uh, I think I'm thinking of a different version of this game. Okay, 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 okay. So let me go up. Didn't even want to mess with that. See, your multi-jump codes, you really need them. You really need them to traverse all this. Oh, is that the thing that's going to open the wall? Yes. Okay, I was thinking of the right game. I was just thinking of uh, it earlier. Okay, let's give him a couple bombs, a couple of shots to the head. They're dead. Level three completed. And again, I'm playing the hard version. <laughs> These things move you. Yeah. Well, that's fine. I don't need to actually be on it to get it. I can just do this. Okay. All right. Down and to the right. Now it's just saying down. Okay. Okay. I see it. I see it right there. We're just going to bomb it this way. I think I got it. Now it's just saying down. Guess I wasn't close enough. All right, fine. You gotta be that way. Fine, be that way. Look at this bridge. It literally falls apart as you walk on it. Get this guy. Got you. Okay, now it's up. Okay, wait, it's still up. Ah, uh, no, don't fall. Oh, look, look, look at it. <clears throat> I don't care for these over-the-head levels for Contra. They need to get rid of these. These stink. I don't like them. That's not what Contra is. Contra is side-scrolling. Left to right, and you just run. That's it. I don't need isometric uh, Contra. Trying not to fall off. Okay, let's shoot this one. I'm shooting it, but it's being uh, turkey. There we go. I gotta go back this way. I was just there. Why didn't you have me do it then? Why are you sending me back? Yeah, I don't care for these, these sections. Yes, I know. Am I going the wrong way? Yeah, I find these parts boring. Okay. I don't even really need to shoot the bad guys because they just die as they touch me anyways. Okay, up and to the right. 
Okay. All right. Just making sure. Okay. No, I can't go by that. Okay, I'm going. Now it's down into the right. Oh, I see it right there. Okay. It's on the screen. Yes, I can get it. There. Done. Okay, here we are again with this thing. Let's get right in the middle and just bomb it. See? There, gone. That's how it's done. Alright, what's this number? Level 4 completed. I only think there's like 5 or 6 levels. Maybe I'll try and finish this. Do a complete playthrough on Maniac. I've been called a Maniac. I've been called a lot worse. Well, that's what happens when people are afraid of you, you know. A lot of people are afraid of me. A lot of people. I don't know why they're afraid of me. I'm a, I'm a sweetheart, but... Okay, we're going to get him. Yep, we're just going to do this. Don't die. Okay, I think I died. I went too high. All right. Yeah, you don't want to jump too high or else with this code, well, I don't think the code has anything to do with it. You go off screen, you're dead. Whether it's off screen, below, or above. Which, normally you wouldn't be able to jump that high anyways, but it's just how it is. Alright. Let's see, can I get him here? You know what? Let's just do this. Nope. Oh, wow. I like how he's dead, but the rest of his body stays part of the scenery. Yeah, so for Game Boy, this is a pretty good version of this game. Look at that thing. Okay, you know what? We're not going to... Look, it's carrying me. Oh, you can... Do, 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 do. Look like a frog. Man, this guy's hard to kill. Yeah, I'm just going to bomb him. Again, this is Maniac, so it's going to be a harder version. Okay, I think I got him there. Yeah, you're dead. See? That's what happens. You know, basically all of these games are just Rambo Commando. That's all it is. Man, I don't recall it being this uh, big of a section here. Alright, now what? Okay, if this ain't the final boss, then there ain't one. Okay, you know what? Do -do -do. It's like you're shooting the guy and it's not really doing much, so you might as well just bomb him forever. It's a good thing I put in infinite bombs. There we go. See ya! Well, I'm only up to going on 19 minutes for gameplay. That's not bad. Congratulations, fighting with all your skills and cheat codes. You have defeated the forces of evil and their leader, the Red Falcon. The world is at peace again. So Lewiston is at peace. Your weapons rest as the celebrations all over the planet commence. And in Lewiston. But who knows, perhaps one day, the Dark Fort... That's why I don't read these things! Because they don't give you enough time to read them. Anyways, that's the game. That's uh, Contra, Alien Wars, for the Game Boy. I have it turned down a little bit for volume because the music kind of stinks. It's Game Boy. The system came out in 89, I believe. So, you know, it is what it is. So, what do we got? We're at going on 20 minutes now. Not too bad of a length for a video. I wanted to do a complete playthrough. I like the, I like the Contra games. Um, there's some other ones I want to do on this channel. I've done them before on my old Chunky Jeffrey channel. But I'd like to do them again here. <clears throat> yeah, 
Yeah. Oh, I got to see the new Super Mario Brothers movie the other night. Uh, my wife and I got to see it. It was not bad. I liked it. Um, would have preferred the traditional Martinet voice for Mario instead of Chris Pratt. I mean, I think he did a good job, but he's not Italian as far as I know. And he doesn't sound Italian. He doesn't do the, it's a me, Mario. He doesn't do that kind of a voice. So it just seems like Chris Pratt talking for Mario being Chris Pratt, you know. So they need to, I'd like to see them edit the video and put Chris uh, Martinet, the voice of the real Mario. It's funny, they had Martinet as Mario's father, so that was kind of cool. But it's a good movie. If you like Mario, pick it up. I'm going to buy it on Blu-ray when it finally comes out. I'm going to pick it up. So I can have it for my video game kind of collection. It was pretty good. I'm assuming they'll probably do a sequel. I think it did good in the theater. I don't know. But we'll see. Okay, so I'm at 21 and a half minutes. So I'm going to let you guys go. Thanks for watching. See you next time.